What's up, everyone? Happy Friday. Coming to you live from the baseball field again. Hanging out on the old glory over here. We got the bike out. What a difference a day makes. Wow. Last night was like a hurricane when I was riding. Cold, wet, windy. It was blowing so hard. It almost blew me off the bike. Lightning. It was a good time. Good time. But uh, we ride at dawn. No matter what, we got to ride. You got to get the ride in. So uh, now we are over here at the baseball field. I've come to you from here before. This is our friend Kevin Brady's playground over here at DPW over here. And uh, the boys are getting ready for the first game tomorrow. Uh, opening day for Little League. Beautiful sunshine day. So we got to get you message of the day. Well, message of the day. What should we talk about? Let's talk about shake it off. Shake it off. Right? So... When stuff comes at you in your life, do you shake it off or do you let it change you? Uh, when people come at you, when situations come at you, uh, do you change for people? Do you change your mental state? Do you lose your joy or do you shake it off? Uh, sometimes it's tough to shake it off, but we got to be conscious about it. When someone comes at us, I know it's not going to affect us. Don't let it affect us. Don't lose your joy. Shake it off. Shake it off. So, you know, as you're younger, even still today, uh, you hurt yourself. You do something not too bad. You shake it off, right? It goes away. Um, you know, a little kid, uh, when they fall down and uh, they look around to see if anyone's looking to see if anyone's getting upset. If no one gets upset, they shake it off. They keep going. If you make a big deal out of it, well, then they make a big deal out of it. So when things happen, you got to learn to shake it off. Got to learn to shake it off. You can't let things get to you. Well, the boy's up. He's batting. There's Joey. Let's see. Let's see what he's going to do. A little commercial break here. Let's see if Joey's going to hit. Let's see. Let's see. I don't know if you guys can see him over there. Oh, 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 oh. So in baseball, remember, any of you guys have played back in the day, you get hit with the ball. What do you do? You shake it off, right? goes away. Ignore it. It goes away. So when people come at you, situations come at you, you got to do the same. Shake it off. Let it go away. Oh, oh, let's see what he does. Let's see what he does. Uh, uh, uh. Let's go, Joe! Uh, uh. No. We got the pitcher machine going. That was definitely a ball. What we got here? Yeah. Oh. Strike. He's been connecting lately. Once he gets connected, this thing's going to go. Let's see. He's been pitching too lately, which is kind of cool. There you go. Oh, a little foul ball. Foul ball action going on right there. Great American pastime here. Baseball. Little league starting up. Let's see what he does. Let's get a hit, Joe. There you go. There's a crack. There's a crack. There's a crack. There you go. Yeah, Joe. Oh, 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 a double, a double. Oh, I got a double off of that one. That was good. All right. So, message of the day shake it off. When stuff comes at you, just like you're getting hit with a baseball in Little League back in the day, you shake it off. It goes away. It doesn't bother you after a little while. Don't let it bother you. If you let it bother you, it will bother you. So, there's your message of the day. All right, so it's Friday. Beautiful sunshine day. Let's jump on prayers over here. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death, amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Amen. Dear God, help us to let things, help us to shake things off, and help us not change who we are and what we stand for by the things that happen to us, by the situations, by the people that come to us. Help us to stand strong in what we believe. Help us strength, stand strong in our faith, and uh, help us to not waver. Amen. All right, everyone. Friday. Beautiful sunshine day. Look at that. Beautiful blue sky. Old glory waving there. All good stuff. Look at that. 
nothing better than a blue sky with a flag waving in front of it. All right. It's game time. Little League opening day tomorrow. 9 a.m. I believe the festivities start and uh, the season kicks off. We got a game, uh, I think, at 3 o'clock tomorrow. And then uh, we got a game Sunday, I think, 9 o'clock in the morning. Baseball season is here. And uh, it's kind of fun. This, they're at an age now, uh, Joey's nine, where uh, they actually start to play for real, and it's fun to watch. So good stuff, good stuff. So uh, if you're not doing nothing tomorrow, come down to opening day here at Harris Field. Uh, everyone will be down here. It'll be fun festivities. Always a good day in Malvern. And uh, then I got an open house tomorrow. Um, we're doing the uh, first open house at my new listing at 541 Linden Street in West Hempstead. That is a four-bedroom, one-and-a-half bath, uh, center hall colonial on an 85 by 150 lot. We got that up at 699, open house tomorrow, 12 to 130. Uh, we also have uh, the Elmont house, um, A Street in Elmont. That is a mother-daughter. It is uh, 2,300 square feet. Nice big house, um, great location. Uh, that one is up for 799. That Contracts are out on that one. Buyer's got cold feet, back on the market. Don't miss it this time around. Um, and then Sunday, we got another round at uh, 541 Linden in West Hempstead. That one's going to be 12 to 2. And then we have uh, 266 Foster Avenue uh, in Malvern. Uh, that one is 679. That open house is 2 to 4. So we got three new listings, three new houses up on the market this week. Uh, I also have the Rockville Center listing coming. Uh, that is a six bedroom, three bath, 3,000 square feet. Um, Rockville Center, we got that up for 1.2. So, uh, that's a big one right there. You're looking for a big house, we got it for you. The whole house was renovated in 2014. Nice, big, beautiful house. Part of Rockville Center, right by the golf course. So, uh, got some stuff coming in for you. The real estate market is still busy. I have tons of buyers out there. If you're thinking of selling, the time is now. Interest rates are starting to rise. Uh, it seems like everyone's looking to jump and buy a house quick before the rates come up. There's really been a spike in action from what I've seen. So, uh, I mean, it's been busy up until now, but since the rates are creeping, everyone's scrambling to buy something before the rates get any higher. So if you're thinking of selling, talk to me. Let's get your house on the market. Let's take advantage of this little rate increase where people are getting a little crazy and trying to buy something. We'll get you top dollar. We'll get it done quick. Make it nice and easy for you. All right. Remember, I got a team that works with me. So when you sell with me or one of my team, you get a whole team working for you for the same price as a single agent. You can't beat that combination. Um, We've sold a ton of houses around, and we just keep going. So um, if I can help you in any way, reach out. Free advice is always given. Um, you can reach me anytime, 917-509-0506. Brian Lewis with the Brian Lewis team at eXp Realty. Uh, if you're a realtor out there struggling, I know there's a couple out there that are struggling. If you're struggling in this market, um, you need help. Um, I have a coaching program for realtors um, weekly. Um, you can either become part of my team or uh, you can join my coaching program, and I can help you be successful. Because if you're not successful in this market, um, you're not going to be successful in any market. So we need to work on that with you. All right, everyone. Appreciate you all. Have a happy Friday. We'll see you tomorrow at the open house.